Hi guys, I am going to change Mr. Crewman into his Christmas outfit for everybody tonight, or this morning. It's actually early in the morning, and today's the 12th. Today's December 12th. It is a Monday. You. <laughs> but yeah, you're looking at Mr. Crew, and he still has a summer outfit on, so he really needed to get changed. He looked sad, so I'm hoping that this video will cheer him up a little bit. He did get a new Christmas outfit this year. I picked him up this from the Walmart. It's a one-piece romper in this pretty tan oatmeal-ish color with the reindeer on it. It's got the little puff, colored puff balls on the um, antlers and a little collar. It's super cute. Little brown puff ball nose. This is in a size 18 months because these run small. So he did get that for his... Gosh, is this his fifth Christmas, guys? Something like that? So he got a new outfit, and I think he's going to look really cute in it. And I found these little shoes to match that are the same color. I wanted some more Christmassy shoes, but I am lacking in shoes for my toddlers, guys. But this is Crew Elliot. He was reborn by my mom, and he is so cute. He's just really hard for me to get in the frame. I'll show you his feet when I'm done. And yes, you'll have to excuse my very old... 20 plus year old purple moo moo. I've worn it in many, many videos and I don't plan on not wearing it. It's super comfy. And usually it's freezing down here. Tonight it's not so bad, so I don't have on my big fuzzy bathrobes. So I'm actually enjoying it down here right now. So, oh, don't scoot away from the camera, buddy. Oh, is he still in the frame? Yeah. But he says, hi, guys. I haven't seen you guys in a while. I think he needs a stuffing adjustment. When they sit for a while, everything tends to go toward the bottom. <laughs> oh, hi, sweet boy. Oh, he's so cute. I forget how cute he is. But, yeah, let's get him his Christmas outfit on for you guys. And so, guys, I'm just in a good mood tonight. Well, this morning. Because my mom is done with my baby. She's done with my Christmas baby. And she's made her a surprise. I will show you guys. My mom is so crafty and so talented. I'm so blessed and so lucky to have her in my life. She's the best mom in the world. Not only is she the best mom in the world, but she's super talented. And I can't wait to show you guys. So that will probably be sometime today. Hopefully not the next day. I cannot wait to show you guys what she has made and the kit that I've got. And what my mom done was was randomly pick one of her boxes that she ordered the kits in. And whatever box she opened. Because the box doesn't say the kit on the outside of it. So that's how she chose the baby. It was between three. And so I'm super excited. I was going to be excited for any of them, but... Um, glad that she picked this one. Yeah, so yeah, this will fit him. But yeah, I did get a few new Christmas things this year. I had to because I was trying to use things for some of the babies, like my twin girls. I don't think that they will be able to have a different outfit than what they had last year. Just because where we live here, newborn is scarce, guys. There's not a lot of newborn to choose from. I would have had to order something and I just don't like to do a lot of ordering around this time of year. Like our mailman today was out till nine o'clock. I feel so bad for him, bless him. But he brought the wrong package to the door and I caught it before he went away. He walked away. He brought someone's package to someone else's package to our door. And I'm just so glad that I caught him before he drove off. But I, I mean, I would have t taken the package to the rightful house. But I felt so bad for him because it's, oh, I would hate. They, they should get like such a huge raise during the holidays. And I don't think that they do. But anyway, he looks so cute. This is so cute and comfy. So yeah, I don't like ordering a lot of things right now. So got him these white socks to go with his shoes but um yeah I think I'll change my other toddler Tessa too I'm trying not to make too many Christmas videos like changing videos because 
I don't, it's going to get old. But I love to watch Christmas changing videos. I love to see what everyone's picked out and puts on their babies. I love them. So, yay, Lizzie's in little socks. What you looking at, bud? Would you say hi to everybody on YouTube? Say hi, everybody on YouTube. Look at that sweet face, guys. But these are, these were Cody's. These were, I don't know. I think they're just Amazon shoes. My GGPP. It says girl, but a lot of these have to be for a girl. These could so be for a boy. So he's wearing them. I think they look cute. And the strings even match this little color up here. Julie ordered these, but they were for Cody. But they say girl on the bottom of them. <laughs> it says my GGPP girl something. But I think they're cute. And that does not have to be just for a girl. But, yeah. There we go. Now, I don't have any shoes for Tessa. And I've been looking for some, too. I need to go to Once Upon a Child. And I just hate going to Once Upon a Child because those bins of shoes, you have to drag them down and then go through them. And it hurts your back. And you get in people's way. Or at least at my Once Upon a Child, that's how it is. Everything's so... Messy, but I really need to get in there and find her some shoes because I haven't found any in the store either, guys. I'm telling you, where we live, it totally sucks for shopping. For, um, oh, he looks so cute. You have to excuse the lighting, guys. I know. Why well, won't my tripod work? Mm. Anyway, look how... Oh my gosh, guys. I'm super failing. But look at his little sleeping reindeer. That is so cute, buddy. I'm glad I got the 18 months because it's comfortably... It fits him comfortably. So, his hair's not even that messy because he sits up. So... But I still want to comb the dust out of it in case there's any dust. But, yeah, our our shopping is not good. Around where we live for baby stuff. And our Walmart and Target. They never have any good shoes for babies whatsoever. They do for toddlers, but they don't have... See, his hair is cute the way it is. I'm not going to mess it up too much. There you go, buddy. You really don't need much. You're so handsome. Say hi to everybody on YouTube. But while I have him here, looking all cute... I guess I want to add something to this video. My saint of a mother. Say hi, guys. Sorry about the awkward lighting on his pretty face. But if you want to see some really pretty videos of him, or some really good lighting videos, go back a couple of years before I, in, in my old nursery that I had. And that's where the lighting was good for him. It's not good for him here. But anyway, I want to show you guys a kit that my mom bought for us oh she bought me this which i'm going to use on one of the girls i just hadn't decided this was going to be for our new baby but she can't this doesn't work for her new hairstyle which is fine because i got plenty of girls that will use it and i love that it's beautiful and but my mom got us a key guys so here's the face yay i'm so excited she'll be Join in the nursery sometime that in this upcoming year. So that will be exciting. Here's her body. I think she's a newborn size kit. Here's one of her little chubby legs. Feet so cute. One of her arms. Not much to see in detail wise in this in the limbs. But that's not what I got her for. I got her for the cute face. Now, I do love this hand. So cute. But anyway, anybody know who she is? She is the limited edition vinyl kit Colton Blue by Georgia Piggott. I fell in love with her face. I just couldn't help it. Mom and I couldn't help it. We are actually ordered her on our vacation. But yeah, and um, this is really cool. I've got to do this later. Georgia's got this new thing where you can register your kit. You can certify your COA here. So that's going to be interesting. 
And uh, she is number 144 out of 800. So, yeah, protect your investment. Please register your kit using the QR code on your COA. So, I'm going to do that. I love this kit. She's actually going to be um, a biracial baby. So, I'm excited about that. Mom and I are going to do her in a biracial skin tone. And we are so excited. Hopefully, we're going to do her. But, anyway, I don't know if she's going to be a boy or a girl yet. But, look at that face. B-E-A-U-T-I-F-U-L. Thank you so much, Mother. I love the prototypes. They are all beautiful. And there's that embossed COA. These, the sculptors are doing more and more in their power to fight, to fight the knockoff and fake kits. I just hope it works for them because I really hate to lose our beautiful, beautiful sculptors. We buy only authentic kits. Yeah, but, um, so thank you so much, Mom. She gave me the box. I don't want to show her address, but she gave me the box and kept the kit there. And while I was up there, I brought some more kit of my COAs home that just were at Mom's. My, my, uh, Kaiko certificate was up there at Mom's. And my, um... Oh, I can't show this one because that's the kit that <laughs> I'm going to be showing you guys today or tomorrow. But, yeah, I'm so excited to get her done sometime. She'll be a 2023 baby. I don't know when and <laughs> what, when we'll do her because we have so many other kits to do. But we have her. And we'll also be getting, um, um, why can't I think of it? Laura Lee Eagle's new big kit be getting her sometime this year but thank you guys for watching crew man's changing video and he looks so cute i'm gonna read the comments to him guys so you guys leave him a nice comment he already looks happier and he has his little glasses that he can wear sometimes he has his little glasses so cute <laughs> i love him in these little glasses guys can you see now buddy i think we'll let him wear them for a while but anyway that's my crew, Elliot, and I think this is his one, two, three, four, five, four, or fifth. I think this is his fifth Christmas, so he's five, and I just enjoy him so much, and I did find my Christmas lovies, and I need to drag those out, but like I said, I'm going to do a whole collection video, so you guys stay tuned for Tessa next, Tessa and Promise, and guys, that is just my pile of blankets. Sometimes I sleep in this room because it's dark, and I have the big roll out pile of blankets so that's what I do and I'm not just going to take them out of here because then I'll just have to bring them right back in but uh yeah thank you guys for watching I hope you enjoyed crewman's changing video I think he looks so cute and he's going to sit over here beside his little chunky brother bear and look all cute and uh yeah I hope you guys have a wonderful Monday bye guys